Duarte. How are you? Yay! My name is Liz Riley, and I'm Mayor Pro Tem for the city. I hope you all are here to have a really good time. It's cooled off a little bit, so the weather is just perfect. The breeze is blowing. The fire that we had a little bit in the uh, by the river is out, mostly. It's only smoking a little bit now, so everything's going to be good. We're having a wonderful day, and uh, I want would like to introduce a sponsor for today's evening. It is Rutan and Tucker, who happens to be our attorneys with the city, and I want to tell you they do a fabulous job. So, and um, so I'd like to introduce David Cosgrove, their representative, our our personal attorney and representative, uh, and thank him very much for the sponsorship for this evening. We, uh, we, we love our concerts in the park, and without sponsorships, we would not be able to have as many as we can. So let's have a really big round of applause for our attorneys, David Cosgrove. Thank you all very much. Thank you. Uh, on behalf of uh, my firm, I want to thank you, the community of Duarte, for uh, the ability to serve you all. We, we, we really love working uh, with this city for a lot of reasons, but most of them is the strength of the community that we see out here. You've got really strong leadership, uh, a focused and established city council that's a joy to work for, including Liz. Uh, we've got a lot of diversity in the community that gives a lot of energy and just a whole lot of bond that the community has. And that's something that you don't see in every community. And most of all, this is a community that has a strong sense of community itself. You can see, you know, this isn't a community of people where they stay behind their laptops and look at their phones all the time. You get out in the park, you do stuff, and, uh, you know, you, you share experiences together. And that's something really special. And like I say, you don't see that everywhere. So thank you for the opportunity to be a part of such a great community. Okay, so um, we have a certificate of appreciation and we have a small gift which happens to be these, these wonderful succulents because after all we do have to be careful. This is a time still of drought and we still have to be water wise and what better than to have succulents that we can uh, take care of. Now. Um, I was looking to see if there's, is there any council member, other council member, I did not see. I did see our school board member, Tom Reyes, where are you? Give a wave. And we thank you very much for coming. I don't think I see anybody else, right? All right. And so now I would like to introduce Dave Cosgrove again for the uh, introduction. So if you came here to listen to a lawyer talk, please raise your hand. Now, if you came here to listen to some really good music, please raise your hand. All right, so we've got a very special treat for you tonight. Uh, we've got a band that has been playing together since the late 80s. For you younger people in the audience, that's two President Bushes ago, okay? And uh, the base of this band is the blues, and that's 12 bars of magic in and of itself. But because their roots are in East L.A., you're going to get a Latin feel and a Latin sensibility to go with those blues. It's something very unique. It's something you're really going to love. So I'm not a hype man, but I've been to enough concerts to know that the energy you get out of a band is very much equivalent to the energy you give in welcoming them. So please, put your hands together for the Delgado Brothers. <laughs> Hi everybody, thanks for coming out. You get a chance, look behind you, it's beautiful. I know you were the one 
morning, everybody. It sound okay? Yep. It's so nice to be out here. And, uh, the, we lucked out with the weather. I think you would agree. We're going to do a song now that was off our, uh, our last record. It's a song called Be The One. My, uh, my brother Stevie, the drummer tonight, he sang the last song for you. He wrote this song for me and my wife, Rena. This is for a wedding gift that he had. He has no money, so he wrote this beautiful song instead. I, I'll take it.
with Joey Delgado on guitar, isn't he? Something else. Yeah, how about a big hand for all the children in the park today? I love kids. I have three of my own. But they're not little anymore. I don't have to worry about them on the monkey bars. Thank you. 
Thank you very much. We have uh, the last song is the title track of our upcoming new record on Bell Asher Records and Tapes. They still make tapes. Anyway, you could I guess you could transfer it to a, a Memorex if you have that machine still. But uh, that song is called Two Trains, written by uh, the Brothers. This next song is also written by the Brothers. It's also going to be on the new record. It's a song called 450 Mulberry, Never Forget.
Luther King. That song was written in Memphis, Tennessee. Time will never forget. Well, we have some good friends that have shown up tonight. I'd like to say hi to Robert, John. We go back about 45 years, is that right? <laughs> we used to play ball together when we were kids. Now we're all grown up. Look at us. All grown up. So this song is going to be off a new record as well. We're going to have a CD release party at the Langham Hotel. August 11th. Langham Hotel, Pasadena. Mark the calendar.
that we made Don't you know I'd give anything I'd sing you a love song If I could only sing If I could only sing to dedicate this next song to our good buddy Sam Ramirez. He was a seasoned tomato. Thank you. 
just want to talk to my Beautiful evening. Thank you everybody for coming out. I know it's it's hard to get out of the house, but I think you I think you think it's worth it. Feeling good? It's a song uh, this next song we wrote uh, dedicated to Mother Earth. It's called Man Without a Plan.
the temperature's rising, the trees are still breathing, but starting to fade. The rain in the dances give no second chances. If we don't stop thinking, it all goes away. right now for over 45 years so it's been a long time the reason we are the Delgado Brothers Blues Band my big brother Bobby Delgado on the bass Bobby Delgado on the bass guitar formerly of the Exotics and Hiram Josh look him up <laughs> my little brother Stevie D on the drums right and carrying on our good friend he's only been in the band for 20 years David B. Kelly we're gonna keep him yours truly Joey Delgado thank you so much for coming out tonight appreciate it if you'd like to support live music please take a CD home with us but pay for it first <laughs> out today. Uh, can you believe we started with kind of gloomy weather? We had a fire, it was hot, and then it was cold, and now 
the sun is out. And I think it's because they're here with us, um, awesome. singing to us. And I know there's a fan base out there. I think this front section, um, they're great. So it's awesome. And give us a round of applause for yourself for coming out this week um, and every week, actually. I can tell you guys are telling your friends and family and children. Tell them every week, because we have two more after this. Um, but yeah, I have an announcement for you guys, actually. Um, so, we have lovely vendors today, uh, every week actually. We have Bien Foods, they have corn, tortas, everything. Um, we have a concession right here too with funnel cakes that are amazing. Um, we have our lovely chamber who um, are actually going to do a raffle soon. We have Parade Committee. Um, they have another raffle too. Those are the blue tickets. So soon it's going to be the pink tickets and they have the blue one but not the end. Um, so we just want to thank all of our vendors for coming out each week and um, supporting us. Oh, uh, we also, let me not forget, our DC TV right in the middle. Without them, um, we wouldn't be recorded. And then you guys can watch us again and again and again and again. So thank you so much, uh, DC TV, for recording our um, concerts every week. Um, without further ado, can you give it up for our chamber, Tina? Round of applause. They're here every week, too. Uh, they're going to do a raffle for you guys. An awesome basket. Two baskets, actually. So let me... Good evening. Is this a gorgeous night or what? Aren't we lucky to be here? I mean, really. I'm Tina Heaney from the Duarte Chamber of Commerce. And tonight we're going to uh, raffle off two baskets. First one, five two five two two nine. For a little basket of fun. Five two five two two nine. <laughs> she wants it, so here we go. Yours? Come on, come on. Oh, you're just getting in the front row to see who won. Well, one more time. Five two five two two nine. <laughs> okay, we're moving on. Five two four two five one. Five two four two five one. We have a winner back there. Where? Wait, Maddie? Woo, here she comes. That's Maddie from Curl Print. Her dad works for her. His name's Adam. So here we go. Next ticket. 524694. 524694. Five, One more time. 524694. Coming, coming. All right, yay. So thank you very much for joining us. Come see us in our booth. Okay, um, you know what, one more thing. We do have our lovely face painting set, um, station over there for public safety. They are here. I see a lot of lovely faces out there face painted, so if you guys want to stop by. And then I also want to thank our sponsor today, uh, Retin and Tucker, uh, for sponsoring us. Um, yes, without our sponsor supporting us, we wouldn't be here. So thank you guys so much. And then, um, now it's my favorite part. So if you guys want to send your kids up, I already have my helper ready. Kids, kids, kids. I see a lot of kids. They're coming. Run. Tell your friends. All the kids. Yeah, kids, kids corner. Bring them. And Jumper. I don't know if they can hear me. I see our winner coming up. She's running. More kids. Parents with kids. Young kids. You can bring them. No parents, though. We 
We need it for the little kids. Oh, they're all at face painting. Any more? All the same? Yeah, I was like, let's see, they're gonna get our jumper ready. You guys have to tell your friends. You have to tell your friends every single week. Well, it's all right. You guys get a lot of gifts today. Oh, I have some more. Oh, they're coming. They're coming. They're coming. And each week just gets better. I ordered a lot of cool prizes for you guys. No, we don't want adults here or staff. We just want the kids. Just kids. We're going to wait a few, a uh, few minutes, seconds. They're coming. Each week. Aren't you guys ready? Why are you guys so quiet? Like last week, too. I have a screamer at the soccer shirt right here. Can you do a little scream for all of us? <laughs> you guys, thank you. I, audience, scream. Thank you. See, why are the audience members more hype than you guys? You guys have to scream right here or you guys aren't getting any. I'm just going to walk off stage. Ready? Do a little scream. Better. Oh, they're coming. Tell your friends. Everyone's coming. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hi. More? I don't want to start without you. I have my helper here. She's always here. She sacrifices. She's going to throw them out to you guys. Any more? I see them. Run! You guys are so cool. What do you guys want to do this week? Because every week... You guys are so blasé up here. Ready? What do you guys want to do? Little dance or jumping jacks? Because last I can do. We can do push-ups too. Actually, I'm all for healthy city living. Dance? All right. What kind of dance do you want to do? A little wiggle? Or oh, okay. We did a robot right here. He he did it. You guys have to do it now. Everybody has to do it. The robot because he suggested it. Everybody, or we're not getting prizes this week. Everyone, everyone. Any more dances? Yes, see, yes, the participation. Go ahead, what dance, go ahead. What kind of dance? What is that? The sprinkler? You guys probably don't know what that is. Uh-huh, you don't know what that is? That's okay, we want you. All right. It's okay, sprinkler, so everybody knows what that is? I don't know, maybe for the young kids? So you put your hand behind your head, you just sprinkle, 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 just like a sprinkler. <laughs> oh, the shopping cart, uh, that funny all right so we are all here I think everybody came from everywhere so should we do a countdown actually another stream it's kind of quiet ready one so everybody can hear you even the neighbors because we want to know that we're here you have to tell your friends each week to come back and each week cooler prizes cooler prizes I might even add up some like light up prizes in there all right you ready another scream and then we'll start scream Woo! all right then can we get a little a little countdown for my uh, assistant, so she knows when to throw them out. Ready? We'll start at five this time, because we're already screaming a lot. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We have more kids, actually. They're coming from everywhere. Brad, hurry, hurry, hurry. We're going to start from five this time. We did our little exercise already. All right, we're going to try to get back there, too. You guys can squish in. Ready? All right, a big one. Starting from five. Ready? Five, four. We're doing a, a this uh, next song is also going to be on the new record. It's a song called "Live for Today." Check it out. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's pretty funky. You know, I gotta tell you, I live in Monrovia, but uh, Duarte's pretty cool. This is awesome. Thank you, guys. It's great to have a great uh, city right next to you, our little town. So this, this is called Live for Today, featuring my little brother Stevie Delgado on singing. That'd be me. Hey, this, this is for my uh, fellow photographer, Ben. This one's for you, brother.
to say enjoy this song but it's it's a good one anyway so this uh will also be on the new record here we go
here, everybody. Woo, I bought a big hand from my big brother, Bobby D. Look at, I didn't notice when he showed up. He said uh, everything was going to be matching, including his amp and his shirt and his shoes. It's almost like an ad for Montgomery Ward. If you remember that, you've been around for a while. Remember Monkey Wards? I love that place. Hey, hey uh, this song goes out to my brother-in-law, Joe. Hey, Joe, what was that song you used to like by Neil Diamond? Love on the Rocks? Okay, so we took that song and we made it our own. So this is dedicated to you. It's, called, it's a song called Talk to Me. Love on the Rocks. <laughs> Ain't no big surprise. Lisa McGee, Mama, Bob's, Babs, Rita Joe.
Thank you very much, everybody. That's going to be on the new record. That is a very special song to the brothers. Miss Pietro's in the house. Look at her. How about our big hand for our sponsors once again, Rutan and Tucker. Thank you, the law offices of Rutan and Tucker. Thank you for supporting live music and this wonderful band of the, like the mountains look even better. Everybody turn around, look, take a last look at the San Gabriel Mountains. Because this is a beautiful sight and Duarte is a beautiful town. Thanks everybody. This one goes out to my cousin. Where's Jimmy? Jimmy? You still here? Jeez. Past your bedtime. <laughs> Joey. Hey, uh, this one. Jimmy, Jimmy was there when this album came out uh, 30 years ago. The Delgado Brothers celebrated, our, or we, actually last year we celebrated our 30th anniversary of our first LP. And I do mean LP. And this is one of the only songs that we salvaged off that album. Just so you know, the band made $89 off that record. This is why we're, uh, we're, we're here. <laughs> it's all about the struggle. Joe was there. It's a song called Fair Warning. Check it out. If I feel a bit abused, 
Let me say this simply So there is no mistakes It's me or him now, baby It's a choice you gotta make Joey Delgado on guitar. Doesn't he something? He's almost my favorite big brother, but I'd have, I don't know, it's kind of hard because I got Bobby D over there on the bass. We got this young fella in the front saying, man, you Delgado brothers, you guys are great. I'm going to support you guys on Instagram, Facebook. I got it all. Man, I... Bobby Delgado on the bass. Stevie Delgado on drums and vocals, Joey Delgado on guitar and vocals, Dave Kelly, keyboards. We got a request to do a song we haven't done for a long time, but I think it's apropos. If you look at the mountains once again in the sunset, thank you for this beautiful world that we live in. A song called No Regrets. Oh, my God. 
thank you so much. Wow, that went fast. Give it up for the city of Duarte for having the brains to have the brothers out here tonight. This is pretty cool. We've never played in the city of Duarte. And I think uh, I'd like to make a habit of this. We're gonna do one more song for you, everybody. We do have, um, we do have CDs for sale. We have a new CD coming out in August, uh, so please look for that. Please like us on Facebook. Uh, look for us wherever you can, and, and uh, you know, I, I hope you enjoyed this evening. We, we had a wonderful time, and we appreciate you guys coming out tonight. Thank you so much. I'd like to wish a happy Mother's Day. I know it's a little bit late. Happy Mother's Day to all you mothers out there. This song we wrote for our mother, and you, I bet you're thinking it's going to be a ballad, but it's not. Our, rom, our mom was kind of, she was a little bit wild, so this is, this is for our mother. Genevieve, we called her Belle. Love you, Mama.
guitar for my brothers. David Kelly, Bobby Delgado, Stevie Delgado, Joey Delgado. Thank you so much. One more huge, huge, huge round of applause for the Delgado brothers. Thank you so much. Oh, you guys a fan base. Thank you guys so much for being here. That was amazing. Uh, amazing. So before you guys go, anyone who bought um, a blue ticket, raffle parade committee, get your blue tickets out because we are, and actually we would like, actually love a band member too. Uh, pick one for us. Everybody ready? Blue tickets out. Oh, drum roll. Thank you. Oh, okay. So, nine, oh, and this is for $32. Uh, nine, seven, eight, two, six, nine.